I always think it's kind of fun doing a compare and contrast between two very similar pedals. So that's what I'm going to do between these two. Um, I've got the Archer by J Rocket. This one belongs to me. And uh, this one is on loan from a mate of mine. It's the, I'm going to say Seriatone. That's probably how you pronounce that. Seriatone Centura. Both cool pedals, and I'm just doing this for the hell of it. I'm going to do it in a slightly different way to a lot of AB kind of videos. I'm going to do it in the form of a track, and then I'm going to remove the track so that you can hear it in isolation afterwards. So some subtle things you'll hear in isolation, and some things in the track you probably won't hear at all, and that might mean that it just doesn't matter. I'm going to start the examples with the rhythm part and uh, for this the game was turned down to around about 10 o'clock. I turned the treble up to or the tone up to around about 2 o'clock and the volume was pretty much at 12 o'clock and the amp is running clean as well. I am on the drive channel of my amp. Uh, if I was to put it on the, the completely clean channel because it's a transistor amp that would sound really quite fizzy and, and not very nice at all. Um, so for best results I'm running it into the drive channel but it is clean in this example. So with the exact same amp settings, I've turned the gain up to around about 2 o'clock and both the other dials are at 12 or thereabouts. When I, turn the, uh, when I turn the Archer on in those examples, I inadvertently knocked the level. So the level is actually on about quarter past 12, maybe 20 past 12. Um, but it is pretty much the same volume, so I don't think that's going to be too much of a problem here. So this is the intro lead and this is basically all of the gain coming from the two pedals and barely anything coming from the amp. Uh, so the final example here is the, uh, the slightly heavier sound when I'm playing the slide and it's exactly the same on the pedal. I've got it set at 2 o'clock and again the other two dials straight up but now the amp is driving more so the, uh, the drive on my amp is now up to around about 1 o'clock um, so you're using this in kind of a boosting capacity but I'm still getting a good amount of overdrive from the pedal itself not just from the amp. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
So is there any difference? If there is, it's real subtle, and I certainly couldn't tell listening to it in the track. Uh, but in isolation, you could maybe hear it, but definitely in the room. I think there was maybe the slightest hint more fizz in the Archer. Uh, but there's also a little bit more low end, and I, I prefer that. So this is kind of, a <laughs> kind of a funny story. So when my mate lent me this one, uh, he said, this is a clone clone, like that little mosky pedal you tried. So a while back, I tried uh, this, this mosky pedal, which is a cheap Chinese pedal. I think it's worth about 17 quid. So I thought that's what he meant about this. I thought, oh, it's kind of like a 20, 30 quid pedal. Um, because you can, you can import these yourself, you know, not, not Centura ones, but it's like B2B shipping. There's a, a Chinese company, you can import them and you stamp your own brand on it. And you can sell it on Amazon. But you can also get them to look exactly like the originals if that's what you want, or you can design your own enclosure. So I've seen pedals that look pretty damn similar on, uh, on eBay for, for 20 quid. So I thought that's what it was. Put it on the shelf, didn't think much more of it. And I tried it probably about a month later. I went, you know, damn, this thing is actually really good. <laughs> if this is 20 or 30 quid, I'm just going to go online and buy one right now, add it to my rig. Of course, it's like 14 times the price of the Mosky. But it's interesting to note that I was under the impression that it's, it's cheap gear, but still thought it was good enough to actually add to my rig. Um, make what you will of that. By the way, this, this rattle, you might be able to hear that on the mic. It was doing that when I got it. <laughs> anyway, thanks for stopping by. See you next time. Later.